Hey guys, welcome back to another week of free and cheap groceries. This is a smaller haul. Um, I might actually do a part two. Uh, today was a PD day where I live and so it was a little harder doing price matching and all this shopping um, with four children along my side. <laughs> so if you wanna see how I saved almost 70% on what I did buy, keep watching. Starting with the maple leaf bacon, uh, it was only $2.37 per package. Unfortunately, I did not have one of those um, coupons from previous packages that said buy two get one free, but if you do, it'll be even cheaper. The Armstrong cheese was only $3.87. This is my favorite kind of cheese and it was on sale at Walmart this week. Uh, it's normally almost $6, so a good savings. The Dove shampoo and conditioner worked out to be 72 cents each. They were $2.97 at Walmart, and then I used this Save 150 coupon when you buy two, and then I redeemed $3 cash back from Checkout 51. The Cheetos were only $1.47 each. They're on sale this week at No Frills for $2.47, and I'm going to be doing something special with them that you might see in an upcoming video, but I used this $1 off coupon printable from Tasty Rewards. The same website, tastyrewards.ca, made these crispy minis free this week. They're on sale at Freshco for only, or sorry, Food Basics for only 99 cents, and then I applied that $1 coupon. The peanut butter worked out to be only $2.13. This is the larger 750 gram jar, and it's on sale at Freshco for $2.88, but then I used this 75 cent coupon printable right from the craft website. The Dempster's breads were 99 cents each. They're on sale this week at Freshco for $1.99. And then if you go to the actual Dempster's website, you can print off a save $1 coupon for uh, either kind of bread. The spiced cider K cups were only $2.50. Sears always has one of those clearance sections where things are marked down, and so they worked out to be a good deal. The Crest toothpaste worked out to be 27 cents each. These are the larger 130 ml tubes. The 100 ml tubes are on sale at Food Basics, but they don't always accept my printed coupons, so I have to price match at Walmart or Freshco, and neither of those places always carry 100 ml tubes. So instead, I saw these were on rollback for $1.27. So since I wanted and needed to get them, uh, I thought 27 cents was still a great deal. The Tide laundry detergent worked out to be $1.49 per bottle. Um, although I unfortunately my flyer delivery is inconsistent, so I didn't have one of the previous inserts where you could save $5 when you buy three, but it was on sale at Sobeys for $2.99 and I was able to print this save $3 when you buy two from P&G every day. So I still got it at three cents a load, which is pretty good for Tide. So overall, the regular cost of this grocery haul would have cost me $143.72. But by price matching and using sales, that number drops down to $74.35. And today I used $27 worth of coupons, meaning I spent $47.35 out of pocket, but I'll still receive $3 back from Checkout 51, and that means the total cost of this haul was $44.35, which is a savings of almost $100, or almost 70%. So if you enjoy these videos, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you share it with others, because I post a haul every Friday, and again, this one might be broken up into two parts because I struggled uh, from being sick and being grocery shopping with four children. So. Next time, hopefully I will get everything that I was looking for. But again, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.